What is going on guys? Welcome back to the channel. Critical Overload here. We're going to be going over this supposed major update we got today about the upcoming new Chucky film that Don Man Senior originally told us was in development several months ago on an episode of the Scream Dream show. And yeah, I'm going to share my thoughts on it because this article I see started gaining some attention once the lovely Jennifer Tilly shared it over on her Twitter page. But I'm going to read through this article and then share my thoughts on it because I do have some doubts about this information. Says fans of horror and suspense, brace yourselves. Chucky is back. Don Mancini, the creative genius behind the Chucky franchise, has officially confirmed that a new movie is in the works. This thrilling announcement has sent waves of excitement through the horror community, promising a return of the iconic doll that has haunted our nightmares for decades. Now, of course, this article, as many of you probably have already seen, was published on August 1st. We are now at August 5th, of course, but they're sourcing the podcast show episode from several months ago. Another aspect of this article says, continuing the storyline, while details about the plot remain under wraps, Mancini has hinted that the new film will continue the narrative arc established in the previous movies. This continuity is something that fans greatly appreciate as it maintains the rich lore and character development that has been built over the years. Expect to see familiar faces and perhaps some new ones, as Mancini is known for, known for introducing intriguing characters that add depth and intrigue to the storyline. Then goes over Mancini's vision. Don Mancini's vision for the new Chucky movie is both thrilling and ambitious. In interviews, he has expressed his desire to push the boundaries of horror, blending traditional scares with the innovative storytelling techniques. Mancini's commitment to the franchise is evident in his hands-on approach to the new film. From writing the script to overseeing the production, he is deeply involved in every aspect, ensuring that the movie stays true to its roots while also exploring new creative avenues. Then it starts going over the production and release. As for the production timeline, filming is expected to commence later this year, with a tentative release date set for next year. The production team is working tirelessly to bring Mancini's vision to life with top-notch special effects and a talented cast. While fans eagerly await more concrete details, the anticipation is already palpable. The return of Chucky is sure to be a major event in the horror calendar. Now again, they're sourcing the Scream Dreams podcast episode from weeks ago. Months ago, I can say at this point. I don't recall any other major outlets talking about this information that viraldes.com is reporting. And I believe this site also runs, this is their news portion, but I believe they primarily function as a clothing source, a source for clothing purchasing. So that's why I'm kind of side eyeing what we have here. It just looks like one of those articles that start recapping old information, then it starts presenting the information in a way that makes it seem as though what they're saying could be factual but they might actually have no idea because i don't see anybody reporting on this not yet anyway maybe this will start gaining more traction because i do have my doubts about this source and what they are claiming because of what i see also in their repertoire i don't see a track record of them covering major things like that a Chucky film filming later this year and no other reputable outlet is talking about it. And the only reason, again, that this, this is gaining traction is because Jennifer Tilly shared it over on her Twitter page. But um, I read it and then I just started looking into who this source was. I see they also function as a clothing brand. So that's when I was like, ah, eh, I don't really see this being something I want to get too excited about just yet because nobody else is reporting on it. Now, by the time this is uploaded, maybe other people are reporting on it. I just don't think we actually are going to start seeing a new Chucky film shoot later this year and then release next year. I will believe that once it comes from some other reputable trade, because this is not a reputable trade and it's not even a familiar online scooper that I'm familiar with that has a track record of covering things such as this. It's just something that really drew me for caught me by surprise, I guess I should say, <laughs> that doesn't really line up with. What I would expect with such a bombshell announcement like this, that a Chucky film is filming later this year, it's releasing in 2025, no one else is covering it. I, I, I just don't, I don't want to get too excited about this, this just yet. It could very well be true, but I don't see much evidence to lend itself to it being true other than the fact that, again, they sourced an episode of the Scream Dreams podcast that was months ago where Don Mancini announced the new Chucky film and their article just seems like they're covering a viral piece of old information, which is fine, but then it has things in it that indicate production is starting later this year. 
It's going to release next year. And yet there's no one else talking about this. No one else is reporting on it. So I'm going to hold my excitement in. Also because of the fact that we don't even know who the hell is going to be involved creatively with the film just yet. If it's all Don Mancini, I probably would be a little bit more inclined to, to be excited only because I know with the TV show, he has way more people involved in the creative room, as you often do. You have your writer's room. I think if Mancini is completely in control once again, if we get something in the vein of Curse of Chucky, Cult of Chucky, more so Curse, mixing it with Bride, I think we'll be fine. I think that there's just too many cooks in the kitchen at times when it comes to that Chucky show. When I look at how many writers are involved and you only have eight episodes per per season, too many cooks in the kitchen. Maybe Don can bring in a co-writer that maybe can amplify some of the shrinks people see present in the current status of Chucky in, in which they think he's too wacky. Maybe someone else can come in for that serious stuff and Don can hone in on the comedic stuff if that's what he wants to focus on and stuff like that. I just don't see this report from Viral Des News or whatever the site was called as something I want to get too invested in just yet because, again, it just seems like they are capitalizing off of something that was already covered four months ago, maybe even longer ago, and now it's being picked back up again and being given more traction because Jennifer Tilly shared it. Because the biggest question I have right now in my mind, not knowing anything about their track record, not seeing that they often report on things such as this, how did they learn that production would start later this year? How did they learn that? I would love to know. <laughs> so if you guys can fill me in, convince me why this is anything to be worth getting excited about just yet, let me know down below. Because again, they also function as a clothing store. If you haven't already, of course, make sure you subscribe, turn on post notifications, and give me this video in the description. I'll have links to all my social media accounts. I am on Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram. You can message me there, of course. Let me know if there's any movies, news, or reviews you'd like me to cover in the future. And with all that in mind, guys, I will see you in the next video.